Do I look orange? I don't even know. Because at this point, it don't really matter, do it? Hmm. I don't know which one looks better, but this, I look cute in this. All right, y'all. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Kayla Denise, back at it with the 50 of, I don't know what to do for my intro, like, I'm gonna be honest. Hopefully I come to come up with one that's like really cute. But until then, I'm probably gonna say what's up. It's your girl Kayla Denise. But anyway, if you are new, my name is Kayla Denise. I'm 19. Um, a little backstory: I like beauty, fashion, skincare, etc. All of that. And I'm so glad you're here. I'm so glad you're here. Now, if you're here and you've already been here before, thank you for coming back. I love you, and I also love you if you're new. Don't, don't think I don't. But anyway, like I said, thank you for coming back. Thank you for being a supporter. You guys are amazing, honestly. Like, even though I'm not as big as I, you know, obviously want to be right now, I'm so grateful because I still have a good amount, and it's just like, people actually watch me still, and I'm just so grateful. Now, as you can tell by the title today, I'm going to be doing a current phase, recent phase, whatever you want to call it. And yes, yeah, so let's go ahead and get to it. Now, I have uh, accessories, shoes, I have a jacket, and some beauty, skincare, hair products. So hopefully this video isn't too long. But um, yeah, so let's go ahead and get started with apparel slash shoes slash accessories. Now the first one I have are these Converse's. Yes, they're dirty. Yes, they're old. Um, probably shouldn't have these on my channel here. But I do uh, plan on buying a new pair probably. These are just like, I consider these my vintage Converse's so I can wear them with anything, you know. Make my, I feel like it's trendy to have dirty Converse's, you know what I mean? Like, to have a good pair that you've had for a good while, that's still, you know, that for some reason that still looks right to me. I could clean them a little bit to make them look a little better, but I feel like that's what gives them the charm that they have. And these go with a lot of things. I wear them all the time. And yeah, I just really love these Converse's. Now the next thing is a purse. This purse is from Express. It's just a crossbody. It's really basic. Um, it has one little pocket in the back here. It's just so minimal and simple, and I just love this purse. Like, I don't know, like it just goes with a lot of outfits, and it means easy. I'm not really a purse person, so throwing this on is literally all I do every day. Now I know it's the summer, I know it's hot, but sometimes it's a little chilly in Wisconsin and at my job, so I throw on this windbreaker, and I got this windbreaker from Zoomies. It was probably like 40 bucks, so I highly recommend you guys invest in a good windbreaker. This does keep the wind away, but I feel like you can um, get a cheaper one somewhere else, but I really like it. It's just black and white, and silver or not silver but gunmetal type of um accents on it on the zipper anyway and it has a hood and it's just perfect for when it rains when it gets a little windy outside when it's a little chilly at your job or wherever you end up going if you go to the grocery store or like church or something so yeah um i really love this jacket and i wear it all the time next we're going to be doing skincare makeup and hair care so let's start off with the hair care so for my hair i have been using this carol daughter's hair milk it's good for nourishing and conditioning. It's a 4-in-1 combing cream. It easily detangles, it enhances curl definition, it enhances natural shine, and it preps hair for perfect styling. This is what has been keeping my hair alive a little bit for like the past month or so. Um, it's just really good with keeping my hair moisturized. Pretty much what it says, in condition and nourished. Like, my hair has been actually looking good. It actually feels good still, because usually my hair is drying. So if you have dry hair, I highly recommend you buy this. And I got mine from Marshalls for $6.99. So, you know, go check out your um your local Marshalls or TJ Maxx, maybe Ross. I don't know if Ross will have this or not, but I highly recommend you guys purchase this even if you get it full price. Now I have some skincare items. So the first one is Witch Hazel Astringent, um, pretty much toner. This gets all your makeup off, and it's just like it is wonders to your skin. Now on the back here it says it helps normalize your skin's natural moisture balance without over drying. It soothes them on irritation after shaving or excessive exposure to nature's elements. And it refines and reduces the appearance of enlarged pores. I'll buy this. I literally got this from Marshalls for $6.99. You can get it for cheaper some other place. Probably Marshalls too, but different brand. But please purchase it. This is needed in everybody's essential skincare routine. Go get it. Even if it's like a different brand, like I said, just go get it. This is... This takes up all your makeup and your face will be clean. Like when you look at the cotton pad when you're done using this, you're gonna be like, my face was really that dirty still. I've drained wiped the makeup off. Like you would think some makeup brands will come through with the moisturizer or not the moisturizer. Will come through with the wipes and the like essential oils and stuff, all that stuff that you use to take their makeup off. But Rich Hazel, they know. Rich Hazel is the real makeup remover. 
Now next, I have this Sephora. Um, this is the Rose Hydrating Mist. It's good for brightening your skin, and rose water is really just good for your skin in general. Um, it quenches your skin, starts with this face mist, enriched with rose extract of natural origin. It's fresh and light texture, penetrates rapidly to moisturize the skin and bring an instant glow effect. I love rose water, so I decided to try the Sephora one, and this one's actually really good. My skin has been clear, my skin has been moisturized. I haven't had dry skin since I used rose water, and I honestly love it. And I hope that in the winter time, this will really come through for me, because like I said, dry skin has a no. Now my next thing I buy, mind you, I buy a lot of these things from Marshalls. This is the Shea Moisture Beauty Hack 100% Pure Sunflower Oil. This has been keeping my skin radiant, y'all. Like, I didn't put it on today because I forgot to put some on. I use the rose water, though. But I use this all the time. It's rich in vitamin E. This oil is ultra moisturizing and softening for skin and hair. Our 100% Pure Sunflower Oil is the perfect addition to any of our any of our bases that needed an extra dose of nutrients and this is like I said really good this was only $5.99 at Marshalls so you might be able to find it there but if not go on the website check it out and go purchase this I wear this like almost every day and I do put it on every night alright so next we're going to do lippies we'll make up really but lippies we're going to start off with lippies so the first thing I have here is the Vaseline Lip Therapy it's in the shade Rosy Lips this right here will make your lips go from cracked, dry, dying to living, alive, not crying okay living, alive, not crying look at it okay you see it go get it next I have a lip gloss I'm wearing it right now okay okay this is the other colors moisturizing glossy lips sheer lip gloss you can get it from the beauty supply store you can get it from your local grocery store you can probably get it from Walgreens Walmart anywhere that sells other colors I even recommend just buying it online honestly Dollar Tree has this go get that from there but yeah I love this lip gloss wear all the time it's my favorite and it's moisturizing like it says and I just love this on and I don't feel like wearing any color next I have a matte lipstick from Anastasia Beverly Hills in the shade Ashton this color is so pretty on me it's like the perfect red pinky shade for me like it's just so cute it's so cute I'll swatch it for you guys um I'll insert a picture of me with it on but look how pretty like when it dries later, when it dries down a little bit later, I'll show you guys on my hand. But it's so pretty and I love it. Like, and I got that from Marshalls for like eight dollars. So if you want the same shade, go check out Marshalls because they might have it. My next favorite matte lipstick is the Smashbox Always On Liquid Lipstick in the shade Stay Neutral. This is a, my other go-to one when I really want to stay neutral, or I'll just pair it with my Chestnut Lip Liner from Mac. And that's literally an everyday shade. Like I said, when it dries down, I'll just show you guys a little later. But I love it so much. My next favorite lippy is the um, Queen Lip Gloss in the, shade, in the shade Zype. I'm sorry if I'm talking fast. I just talk fast. This is not too sticky. It's really pretty. It's a really pretty neutral shade. As you can tell, I love neutral shades. And it's just like good over any type of matte lip. Any, It's good with any, honestly. You can combine it with a lot of different shades. And I love Queen Cosmetics, so I had to purchase it and try it out. And I'm really glad that she actually recommended me this shade. Next, we're going to go in with skin or face products. So here I have a foundation, and it's the Black Radiance um, Color Perfect Liquid Makeup. I'm in the shade 8416 Mocha Honey. I'm wearing it today. It's cute, y'all. It's really cute. I love it. Everyday makeup. I love it. And it's really affordable. It's probably like $5, $5 to $7. So I recommend you go purchase this at like Walgreens or Walmart or wherever they sell Black Radiance. Now what I do with my foundation is I use this Best Stoke brush. I don't know the name of the brush, but this brush is really good. Like I like the bristles. I know it's dirty. I'm sorry. But um, yeah, my favorite brush. For the last two face products, I use this True Complexion Contour Palette in Medium to Dark from Black Radiance. My favorite shade in it is the dark shade, of course. I use the contour. I have it on today. And I just use it every day. I've been loving it because I used to use the Anastasia Beverly Hills kit um, in Medium to Tan. And I like that shade, but this one I feel like is more of a shade for me. So yeah, I've been using this every day. My favorite highlighter ever is the Wet n Wild Golden Flower Crown um, highlighter from Wet n Wild. I already said that. <laughs> and look how pretty it is, you guys. Look, it's so cute. I have it on today a little bit. I'm still kind of learning how to put on highlighter. Like I usually wear a highlighter, but it doesn't come on the same every single day. But this is my favorite one at the moment, and I recommend you guys go buy it. It's not that expensive. I mean, it's one wild, so you should be able to tell it's not that expensive. But you can get this at, like, Target, Walgreens, Walmart, pretty much anywhere. And, yeah. 
Last but not least, I have my favorite eye favorite. So the lashes I have on right now are the Go Glam Multipack Salon Perfect. You can get five pairs of these from Walmart for only $8.44. Yes, sis. $8.44 for five pairs and I've been wearing these a lot like for the past two weeks or so so yeah I recommend these they're really cute go-to everyday glam lashes or you can just wear this you can wear them wear just for any occasion honestly so yeah those are my favorite lashes and then my favorite all-time favorite um mascara is the Lash Sensational Effect Mascara by Maybelline this is my go-to. You can't really tell. If I have only on mascara in a picture, I'll insert it over here. But this is my favorite mascara, and it makes your lashes look so long and so perfect and just so dramatic. And yeah. I wrote you guys, so that concludes my every... Or no. What? Hmm. Okay. Okay, guys, so that includes my current slash recent favorites. Hopefully, you guys like this video. I know I've been doing a lot of vlogs and get ready with me, so I'm so glad I was able to sit down and actually want to do this video. And, yeah, so, by the way, this is the swatches of those lipsticks. Look how pretty. I'm shook. But, yeah, so, thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and click that bell, all right? And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! Hey. Focus on